Hello everyone, I have two Christmas card kits to offer you for these last two weeks of October. So I want to tell you all about your different options. They're very different from one another and the one you even get to pick and choose a little bit of what cards you want to be included in the kit. So um, let me start with the one of a kind snowflake card kit. So um, each of the kits are $28 and that includes shipping everything right to you. And with each of the kits, you're going to make four cards. So the one of a kind snowflake kit includes the one of a kind snowflake dies. This is a simple set of dies. This just these two. It's the more outline and then the more detailed snowflakes. And you do need um, stamp a cut and emboss, Sizzix, some type of machine to do the die cutting. Um, but you'll get those dies, which by the way, if you already own those dies, you can substitute uh, I think, what is it, $13-ish, I think, is the cost of those. So if you already own these dies, but you really want to do my card kit, don't get another set. Just simply substitute, just contact me and be like, hey, I already have them. I'd rather do this product instead. So as long as it's an equal value, or you could pay the difference, um, then you'll have access to those dies, but you don't want doubles. Okay, so I'm excited to show you. Now you're going to see a couple of cards in this kit that are gonna look really familiar to you. This one and this one. They both look familiar because this one was my card from last week's Great American Stampin' Show. Look at that pretty glimmer. And this is this week's, which by the way, I won last week. I had the most votes with this card here. And I'm currently, I haven't checked in an hour or so, but I'm currently in the lead with this one. But Brandy is super close behind, and I think Julie and Shannon are too. So it's a tight race. So if you haven't voted yet, go ahead and do that. But with this one-of-a-kind card kit, you're going to get supplies to make these cards. You'll need to um, have those dies, which come with the kit, and then you can add the stamps with the ink that you want to. So I'm not allowed per Stampin' Up! policy to include stamped images. So you'll add greetings with ink that you have. It doesn't have to be these exact greetings. You can do whatever you'd like. I, um, I will give you details. I don't remember off the top of my head, but I'll tell you... Um, I'll link to some details here and I'll tell you specifically which ones I did use in case you do want to duplicate it. Here's the fun part with this kit. I did the exact same thing. Let's see if I can hold them all. But with a purple, look at that. Isn't that fun? So you've got purple options or the original blue options. These, um, they're just so pretty. So Berry Burst, Petunia Pop, Fresh Freesia, bubble bath they're really really pretty and they have the same glimmer that you see in blue so hopefully this doesn't get confusing but this is what you have as far as options for this particular kit you pay 28 dollars, you get the snowflake dies and you get supplies to make four cards you can do one two three four or you can say you know what i really prefer the blue i would like to do two of each or I really prefer the purple. I would like to do two of each. So whichever way you want to go is fine. So I don't usually do it that way, but some people are really particular about blues and purples for Christmas cards. So you can do one of each, or you can do two of each and two of each. So when you register for this kit, you just tell me what you want. Okay, that is Christmas card kit option number one, the one of a kind snowflake kit. You get the dies, you get supplies to make four cards, um, and that includes the embellishments you see, the ribbons, the glimmer paper, um, the snowflakes here, there's adhesive sheets behind the dies, that will come on there too. So it's, it's quite a bit that's included there, envelopes of course, instructions will be emailed, and um, like I said before, it includes shipping to your door. So kit number one is four cards and the dies. Kit number two is featuring Sentimental Christmas, 
and the sentimental wishes. Let me pull this in first. So this is the stamp set that I used with these um, cards. And I primarily, I think on these, yeah, I just used the greetings from this stamp set. So if you want to complete them exactly as shown, you'll need to get this. If you have other Christmas stamps, that's fine, use them. If you do get these, there are dies available and they're really kind of awesome. They work not only with the stamped images, but also the images that you'll see in the designer paper. So let me pull in these cards. And if these are looking familiar, it's because a couple of them, I think, I know this one for sure, I also did in the Great American Stampin' Show. So let me see if I can hold these all up at the same time in a way that you can see them. So here are the four cards, and I'll just pull them in a little closer so you can see details. So again, you will get supplies, the labels will be die cut, um, the designer papers, the ribbons, the embellishments. This one's kind of fun, opens this way. This one here, I really like this one too. So um, you'll get all those supplies to make these four cards, one of each of these four, and then you're going to get a half, no, take that back, you get a full package of the Sentimental Christmas designer paper. Now for mailing purposes, I will need to cut it down so it won't be 12 by 12 when you receive it. It'll be smaller pieces, um, I'll cut them four by six but all the patterns of designer paper that you're seeing on these cards show you those patterns in the designer paper. Now I will point out this, the die, which I know is right here, there is um, this die that die cuts right out of the designer paper, okay? So that stocking was die cut right from the designer paper. This die also works with the stocking image that's in the stamp set. Now you can order the dies to cut this out. If you just don't want the dies, that's okay. Use scissors and cut it out or just cut around it. It doesn't have to be a tight cut like that. It's entirely up to you. The purpose of these kits are just to give you a starting point and just some fun, quick and creative cards without having to do the design and prep work yourself. So this one is also $28, which includes shipping to you. I'm just looking at my notes to make sure I don't forget anything. With each kit, you're making four cards. The snowflake one, you just get to choose if it's one of each or two blue, two purple, and you get the dies. This one, the sentimental Christmas, you make one of each and you get the package of sentimental Christmas designer paper. Both include instructions emailed to you, Cost includes shipping it right to you. If you decide to do both kits, okay, you have between right now and October 31st to order one or both of these kits. If you choose to order to bro the order both, you're also going to get these just as a little thank you gift from me, free with your package, and they're called opaque faceted gems. So they're sticky on the back. You can see how much they're. They're very faceted, which means the light is reflecting a lot. They're really fun to work with. So if you choose to do both kits, you will get that as a special little thank you in your package. So if you have any questions, be sure to reach out. You can purchase your kits through PayPal or Venmo, or if you need to send me a check, you certainly can do that too. I will um, give you more details typed out so that you can refer back to all of that. But of course, if you have any questions, just feel free to reach out. All right, have a great day.